In this video, we will show you how to convert an Access database to an SQL Server's database. For this, we'll be using migration tools called SQL Server Migration Assistant. You can download it from Microsoft's official website. Simply click on the download button and specify the location where you wish to save it. Next, just extract and open up the setup file to begin the installation. Just follow the step-by-step -step procedure to install the application. In the case if it prompts you for the license key, you can easily download it for free by registering yourself to Microsoft. Once you open up the migration tool, a wizard will open. Just hit Next on the welcome screen and now you can create a new project. Here you can name your project, specify the location, and then choose the version of SQL Server you want to migrate the database to. In our case, we will be migrating to SQL Server 2008. With that done, you have to add the database which has to be converted. Click the Add Database button and locate your database file. Just hit Next after that to continue with the process. In the next step, you can select the objects to migrate. For this tutorial, let's leave this to default and hit Next since we will be migrating the whole database. In the next window, we will have to create a connection with the SQL Server. Provide the server's name, which in this case will be local since it is installed on the same machine, and specify the database name. If you want to create a new database, just type its name over here and the wizard will automatically create it. With that done, simply click on Next. The conversion process will begin after that, and it will take a few seconds for the process to complete. Once done, simply close the migration wizard and open up the SQL Server. Now you will notice a new database has appeared over here. Let's expand the folder, right-click on any of its tables, and choose the Select Top 1000 Rows option to view the contents of the database and you can see over here that the Access database has been successfully converted into an SQL Server's database.